Hello guys, and welcome to some more Norse Norway campaign. Europe and the Sun is 4 with the Conquest of Paradise expansion. So, we are finishing up the uh, British Isles. The only province that is no, not under our control right now would be Kent. And, uh, I mean, they're, they're gonna fall eventually, don't you worry about that. Because uh, we have vassalized everyone else, plus we are annexing two of, our, two of our vassals, so... Yeah, progress is happening, I like it. Uh, we have also figured out that we can't reach the Americas quite yet. We need to wait a little bit longer. Can't even reach Greenland. Wow. Uh, yeah, so we need to get another level to our technology. Oh, we need two levels, actually, of technology. I don't get this. Why is technology so incredibly cheap? Neighboring bonus. Really? Who are we neighboring that is just that good? Increase over time. Huh. 15% of 600, is that that much? Sorry for being stupid and all, but... Yeah, not very good at math. <laughs> I used to actually have like the most difficult math at school, but then I realized I sucked, so I... Stopped having the most difficult math at school. Pretty simple. Seriously though, what, 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 what was I doing again? Why, why is... I, I seem to be suffering from some sort of... Some sort of memory bullshit. Uh, well, 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 I guess we'll never know. <laughs> God. <laughs> okay, uh, but seriously though. I feel like there's something important I'm not paying attention to. Hey, naval supplies, that's good. Well, like, just, just, why? Hungary is like, oh, I'm at war with Byzantium. Well, um, hmm, what would be in my best interest in a war against Byzantium? Oh, I wonder. <gasps> yes, I know, getting access through Norway so that I can enter the provinces of Galway and march my armies from there down to this province and conquer it and gain all the war score. <laughs> yeah, sorry, that's not how the that's not how war works. If you haven't figured that out yet, so. Yeah, you're stupid. But uh, other than that, you're welcome to walk through my lands if you really want to. No, no, I don't want to try and improve it. Anything to avoid losing stability. That's my that's my motto. All right, one more now, and uh, we'll get that uh, extra extra. Oh no, we won't. We need to have two more. Okay. Oh shit. Ay 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 ay. Well, what the fuck are we going to do in the meantime then? Seems like it's going to be a while until we can start colonizing. That's fair, but still, it's kind of annoying. Why is the wind pointing that way? Point that way! I want to get there. Because if not, I'm going to have to get those awkward African colonies that everyone gets in the beginning, That, but that everyone sort of agrees are not actually that good. I'm getting quite a lot per month though, I'm getting 9 per month, so that's pretty good. Hey, we're actually making a decent bit of money. Even with the level 3 advisor. Anything good I could get? To be honest, nothing I really want, so nope, never mind that. Wow, these colonies are coming together rather quickly. Of course, we are speeding through the game quite... Intensively, but uh, I mean there's a purpose behind that because I am using both my diplomats to annex vassals So I can't really do much In three years though, we're gonna be ready to do stuff again. Oh, it's even shorter now until we can finish it sweet Ah oh, nice colonial enthusiasm Always welcome go away. I Remember all the douchey things you did to me back in Crusader Kings You're not gonna get shit I don't know why his stuff is so cheap. If someone knows, then tell me, because I'm confused. I'm just bombarded in awesome uh, stability events. Holy shit. Cool, I'm up to plus three now. Huh. That is pretty amazing. I'm loving it. So, Lithuania is failing at life. So, that's happening. <laughs> Whatever. Yay! 
prestige and self sustainment and Oh, good stuff, good stuff. Okay, let's go south, see if there's anything fancy we can colonize. I know I can colonize this place, but I want to see if there's anything like cool and stuff I can do. Like these islands, they're cool. Let's see if we can reach that. Let's go a little bit back and forth here. Till we find it. Did we find it? Yep, we found it. Go! Go colonize. I mean... He still can't read. Nope, can't read shit. We can't reach jack shit. Oh well. I wanna explore more. This colony should be finished by the time this boat is done exploring, so I sh think I can just retreat back there. Mali is turning into be quite a legitimate nation, because they do have that Mustang tech, and they're reformed. They're actually a sultanate. That's because of the whole save game conversion. The save game conversion tends to do that. Making nations that in the base game are sort of backwards. Quite advanced indeed. Which is fine, you know, I think that's might even be more realistic. I mean the Mali Empire were they were pretty badass, so it's just like they never really did the whole technology advancements as much as the Europeans. So, yeah, sure. Until further notice, we are friends, so whatever, dude, you do what you want. Seriously, why, what are you doing? Why do you want that? I don't even know. Uh, nope, I want the technology. I want the technology. Hey, that was fast. Nice. We have them as a part of our nation now. Derby. With a very bad culture, but that's fine. Our army is big now. It's not big, it's big error, but that's, it's, it's, it's something. Come on, you're dying of attrition. Why can't you go? I know, it's because of my... Fucking... Really? When you defund your troops, you just can't walk at all? Well, that's a surprise. There we go, now we can walk. Lose prestige or lose money. Uh, I want the power though, so I'm gonna buy it. How far away are we from the next military tech? Well, this one is super expensive, uh, but it's because we are ahead of time. Might want to do a military idea next then. I really feel like doing the aristocratic one just to get that extra diplomat. I love having like a incre just a stupid amount of diplomats. It's so nice never running out of them. Oh, you can't walk across this now? Interesting. Could do that in Crusade Kings. Where's my transport ship? Ships. Uh, they're here. Because we still got that guy. So I might actually just go straight away and see if I can annex another vassal. Are you ready, Cornwall? Are you good to go? No, I still have to wait a little bit. Let's try and do Meath, actually. Although, it's gonna be a while. Hmm. I might wanna do one war while we... While I... In the meantime... I'll have to find someone to invade, though. Um, a purpose to invade them. Okay, so there was the Pomerania, who are allied to Sweden. But Pomerania is a lot stronger than they kind of look. So, I don't know, man. I don't know. I'm just not strong enough yet. I need more fancy allies. Okay, so here's the thing. If I were to declare war on these guys, who would would you join me, Sweden? So yeah, temporarily get out of that place. And we'll go talk to... Well, of course... No. I don't know why they hate me so much. Oh, I guess it's just because we haven't improved relations in a while. So Sweden loves me, that's fine. So if I were to invade these guys, would you join me, Sweden? No. Oh, who could I invade then? Who Sweden, where Sweden would join on my side? Sweden would join a war against Poland. Not that we have a Kansas Valley against Poland, but we could always get one, so that's not the problem. Hey, Poland, who are your allies? Everyone in the entire world. Yeah. I mean, I really did expect this to go a lot easier. I mean, the proofs. I mean, we're not as strong as we kind of thought, or I thought, I guess. I mean, but we are, strictly speaking, quite strong, though. We have a lot of troops compared to others. Uh, we, yeah, Bohemia just passed us. But yeah, we did just pass both Gardariki and Poland. Uh, no, Pomerania's even over... Oh, wow, they're still stronger than us. Uh, they have a, well, they, we have strong, we have a bigger force limit though, so we can actually get more dudes. 
It's just I'm just not using. Yeah, no, it's, I can only, I actually just get one more. That's not a lot. Huh. Well, I mean, it seems like we're kind of lost. I mean, really, there is not much to do. Other than just sit around and wait for good stuff to happen, I guess. Let's get a uh, let's get a cannon. Get another cannon. Let's get one other as well. And I'll disband the infantry unit to stay under the force limit. Like so. Okay, good. Make sure we have a proper amount of uh, artillery in the armies. So it's important. Yes. Okay, Meath. Uh, let's talk to you again. Seems like Europe is not too interested in us fighting. So, Denmark, how long till your course go away? Not that long, actually. You're gonna lose your course any moment. Well, or not. Or this is just bugged and... Uh, Denmark will never lose... Okay. Is that the same apply for this one? We'll lose the core 50 years after... So... It is really just a question of time before Denmark loses all their cores, which will m make the whole vassalization of them very, very pointless. So it can seem as if I want, I need to go to war now or never. Why, why, why? Everyone has all kinds of allies. Why can't I have fancy allies? Poland, you want to ally me? No. Then when I, mean, I, I just no. Fuck. So Lithuania would. Ally me, Ruthania would also most likely ally me. If you could just get the opinion a little bit up. Uh, ooh, 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 embassy, embassy, embassy. That's that's uh, that's gonna give us an extra diplomat, right, 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 right. Fucking, where's the build menu? Here's it is. Uh, oh, it's expensive though. Oh. <laughs> we need money. Money. Spend all the things. I think that extra diplomat is going to be important. Important. Uh, okay. So I could ally Ruthenia, invade Pomerania, who are allied to only Sweden. That's good. Very good. But of course, Ruthenia won't be able to help me really. So an alliance with. Lithuania would make more sense, because I would be fighting Sweden and Pomerania. Um, so Lithuania could invade Pomerania, and I can invade Sweden. Sounds logical. It's ally Lithuania. I'm not going to get a... Um, uh, sure. I'm not going to get a, uh, a, 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 a royal marriage, though, but I'm just going to ally them a little bit. I also need that... I also need a reason to go to war. Do I have a reason? No, I don't. Let's get a reason. Let's get a reason. Reason, reason! Covert. Fabricate. I don't really care. Just give me something. Uh, preferably something... Or, uh... Well, I don't even... Let's take something that's easy to occupy for us. Like Mithilam. So I'll wait. I wait on the alliance until I'm actually ready to go to war. Cause I want to keep. I want to get as many points as I possibly can. It's my priority right now. Let's start shipping troops over to the lands of Denmark. Oh, hello! They just annexed that. Uh, did that cancel my thing? It did. No, it canceled my thing. Ah. Uh. Mithyaland, there it is. Good. No. No, 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 no alliance. No mercy. Uh, okay, good, good, good. On to the boat you go. Don't go there, actually. Get the, get ba balance out the arms a little bit. They both have one cannon, or yeah, one one cannon, two cannon, whatever. 
port limits. We are at the max. We can't get any more. That is sad, but... Sad, but true. Uh, military leaders died. Oh, no. Well, I guess that's kind of nice. Finally, we get something to spend our military points on. Or, never mind. We can actually get technology. Good, good, good. Let's get that. Uh, lose power or... Or the other thing, which truly does not matter that much. Oh, pirates. Ew. That's not very nice, is it, now? Oh. Oh, was it the explorer who died? No, no, they all, they're all dead. Well. But I don't think we need to explore anything more, though. We're pretty much good to go. We have explored the things we need to. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, I mean, are we are we good to go? Are we good to go to war? No, need to wait a little bit. Yeah, I need to get that plane going first. Once that's done, though, where then we'll be good to go. Hmm. Here's the thing, though. If I take my troops and I land them in Sweden and just stand up, all up in their face. And then we become at war. Can I just immediately attack their forces, or is that just, it? Or doesn't it work that way? Uh, this is going to be a strain on our, on our economy. Darn it, expensive advisor. Of course, we don't actually need him. It's only a question of time. Uh, time now before we can kick him out. Well, I kind of want to keep him though, because I do want to annex my other vassals as well. And he's 41, so he's going to die soon. But I'll, I'll keep him for, for as long as we possibly can. Sweet! Oh, those events are just so nice. And it finished the colony, actually. Huh. Nice, three colonies already. We are speeding this. And now there is not that much. We could go into this part of Africa, which wouldn't be that bad, actually. There's, just little, there's a lot of dudes here, though, and I can't afford to bring troops over here right now to... Um, to do stuff and things. Yeah, stuff and things. You know what I'm talking about? So, I think we might just have to wait on the colonies, which would be nice, because it's going to help out the economy. So, so yeah. Diplomat has arrived. Okay. Uh, so, any... No, we're still only allied to Sweden. Sweden would not join me. No, they're just kind of douchey. They are douchebags. So, we'll ally them. And... Nope. Sorry. That's far too permanent. But I'll declare war and you're very welcome to join. I wouldn't mind that at all. Oh, they're not even going to join. Well, fuck you then. I don't want to be your ally. Go eat shit. Okay. Well, I guess we're not going to war then. Fuck. I can't. I don't think I can win that on my own. <sighs> okay. Uh, oh, no, it's, well, we just got them integrated, which means we are a lot stronger now. But I don't think we can actually keep that many troops going. No, we can't. We have to disband seven of them. Oh, no, more than that. No, seven. Yeah, that makes sense. Eight. Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah. Sorry about that, but uh, that's just how things are. Okay. Um, I, we're just gonna leave in Denmark, I think. Cause we can defend the Isles with our boats anyway, so we're fine on that. Okay. So now we have both our guys ready to go. So let's go ahead and talk to Dublin and these guys for the matter. So yeah, let's go talk to all these people. These good people of the, the Empire, and, uh, yeah. Take this navy, and we'll go down to, um... Go down to the colonies, yeah! Of course. Yeah, because I want to start colonizing, so I'm going to go ahead and get a conquistador. Conquistador. Like that. And uh, I'm pretty sure we still can colonize America, so we'll we'll derp around in Africa for a while. Well, we can't reach this. 
Well, I kind of was hoping we could. <laughs> we should be able to reach something of this, though, so we'll do that. Oh, uh, okay. No. How long until the next technology? Not that far, actually. So we might actually be a bit... <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. We might actually be better off just waiting to get that last boost. Uh, I have a feeling this is going to finish faster than a potential colony in Africa. So let's do that, actually. Let's not derp around with this. Instead, what I'll do is I'll take the bark. Five. Ah, yeah, let's, no, ah, four, five, I don't know. Well, let's, let's do, let's do five. Yeah, five. Do five. We'll drop a horsey. We'll put you on this, maybe. And uh, we'll leave it in the ocean for now. Because I want to send that over to America. You, on the other hand, can go home. You are no longer needed. Go to Essex. That will be a nice place for you to stay. Are we getting blockaded? Uh, I guess we can stop by and uh, ask, kick some uh, filthy pirates, and then we'll go home. All right. Uh, hey, I guess since we're not going to war, we might as well just get rid of some of that maintenance and save up for that embassy. No! Statement died. God. Damn it! Ay Well, now it's gonna take ages for us to take these guys. By the way, uh, are you are you good to go? Can I annex you? No, very but very soon though. Most likely by the time I'm finished improving relations, I can start the annexation process. So we should be fine there. Mm, oh, that's good. Good, good. Get some more trade do that idea thingy, but I'm not going to do that though, because I need this technology and got to get that extra colonial range. Once we get that actually, I could actually, I could most likely go to Greenland and go North America. I kind of want to do that instead of South, just because I want Vinland. Because I think if you, if you, if you're one of these sort of Scandinavian nations and you colonize um, the Canada region, you'll get Vinland. Oh, really? You popped up immediately? Wow. Wow. Let's actually go up here. Let's go to Germany. You seem to be, I don't know, they, they're just stupid, that's all. That's fine, you know, gotta respect stupid people, but it's, it's just kind of a thing. Uh, uh, I don't know, is it gonna be, I think it's gonna be enough. If we get that boost from technology. So I don't know, can we... Yeah, I might have to stop in Greenland before we can go to America, but that's fine. Greenland is such a nice place, right? So that should be that should work out. Okay, the game crashed again. I why what what is happening? Ah, uh, the funny thing I said I I said I hope this is not a thing, and guess what? It seems to be a thing. The game crashing is a thing. And this is not Iron Man, because you can't play Iron Man. The game simply does not allow you to do that. Which is stupid, because I would actually love love to play Iron Man right now, so I could get those constant saves, so I don't have to redo shit whenever, I, whenever the game crashes. God damn it. Aww. No, I don't want to lose the ability. I mean, if these crashes continue, then I might have to... I, I don't know what to do then. I have no idea what I'll do if the game keeps doing this. I mean, I might have just have to wait until someone patches the game. Because I'm not into the whole playing with a bunch of bugs business thing. I don't like that. So... So, yeah. Fuck, that's annoying. Ha! <laughs> Hate crashes! This is so dumb. I guess I should ex 
I'll um, make auto saves happen more often. So we won't lose as much progress. Okay. It's a little bit annoying, but I think it's it's better. It's it's less annoying having these awkward auto saves all over the place than having um you know, having to restart and having to like redo a bunch of shit. But seriously, Germany, why are you invading France? Like just the logic is just not there. You are this tiny. France is this big. You are not in a position to invade France, Germany. <sighs> wow. That's funny, to say the least. Well, go do do whatever. Yeah, you yeah, you you go have fun, Germany. Okay. Um how long do that technology? I mean, in the crashes, are not, it's not, not not even one of those slow crashes where the game just freezes and then you have to like restart and all that. It's just BAM and it's gone. There's just nothing more to it. It just stops working. Totally out of nowhere. I don't know. Of course, you know, a, a completely fresh patch, completely fresh expansion combined with the save game converter is probably not the best strategy for a stable game, but still. I would hope to get a little bit more. Alright, let's at least get this now. Which should give us all kinds of range. Yeah, we can reach all the things now. Okay, so never mind uh, Greenland. We don't actually have to go there. For some reason we can go here, but we can't go there. Don't really know what's up with that, but sure thing. You also go down all the way down here. Ooh. Like I don't get why can we go here but not there? I don't know. I really don't know what's up with that. So let's get some dudes. Most specifically this guy. Put him on the ships and we'll sail down here and we'll see what we can find in terms of cool stuff. So, how do the regions look? I, I want to start out taking Canada because I want to get Vinland. Uh, colonial regions. So, we need this blue stuff. That's Canada. So... Well, I guess that's what we're getting then. I don't know. What's best? Why are there so many regions in just this little place? Funny. Uh, well, I guess we can start doing this thing. Just a bunch of this different stuff. Could try and pull off two colonies at once. Our economy is beast right now, so that shouldn't be too much of a problem. Yeah, let's do that. Let's get two colonies at once. Yeah. So I'll do the two cheap ones. I'll do I'll do these two. Just to avoid um. Because um, uh, you, whenever you take another colony, that'll be extra. Or if you could do first this one and then a cheap one. Where's the? Is the the? Yeah, this. Oh no, we'd actually do. I'll do Newfoundland actually. Or I'll do this one. Send a guy there. Of course, now I don't actually need that explorer. But um, well, how many natives here? Only thousands. We could actually just leave something like that. And the rest of the army can uh, go and find new lands, I guess. Let's find Newfoundland. Of course, we need to get back to Iceland very soon, so I'll, I'll just leave the guy there. And I uh, will quickly go back unless you... Uh, I don't know. I don't know what's going to be fastest, going back to Iceland or waiting for the colony. I think we should be able to wait for the colony and take that. So let's do that, actually. The Dainish are racing at rise. Oh god. Ah, we still won, even with like no maintenance. Sweet. So, is this gonna be a colony soon? Yes, there it is. Good, go. Alright, first Norwegian colony in the Americas. Sweet. Still, still not a colonial nation. I think you need like five 
uh, provinces in one colony or whatever until before you can get an actual nation. So, I don't know, can, colon can uh, colonial nations expand on their own or do I have to do it for them? That's an interesting question, I don't actually know man. So I think we're just going to recall this guy immediately and I'll try and establish a second colony in uh, Newfoundland. Which makes them immediately attack. I should probably fund this a little bit more. And then we will begin the uh, Norwegian uh, Colonial Empire. Oh, they love rising up, don't they? Yeah. Should probably balance this a little bit more. I mean, it's... Yeah, there's like 500 natives there. We be, we'll be better off having more dudes in this province. So, let's do that. Let's bring one dude over to Acadia instead. Just do further defend this. Let's actually also bring the general over. It's actually a really good general. <laughs> Interesting. Anyone who provides extra growth for colonies? Anyone at all? Nope. Does not look like that's the case. Very well. Should I get an explorer maybe? And we'll go take a look at some more of the Americas. See how things look. Sure, let's do that. Let's split off a little bit of an exploration navy. Put an explorer in there, and let's go take a look at the world. See how the natives have, have been doing, um, or what they've been up to, or whatever, you get what I mean. Sure, I guess. Sure. You do whatever you want. Nope. Fuck you. <laughs> I think that's going to be a thing, hating on the Ilkhanate. What? Swedish conquered it. Really? I mean, I'm not going to lose that prestige just because of bullshit, but I'm not going to help you. So that's what you thought. Oh, man. Getting a colony in Louisiana, that would be badass. Maybe one day. Maybe one day. Let's get home. Hmm. Get rid of that time at sea penalty. So this is interesting. Uh, you can see how there's actually quite a sizable chunk of derps who are actually coastal of the natives, which means we can just go in and conquer these guys and create some sort of a colony down here as well. A lot of these guys are coastal. Wow. Oh, well, I might... I, maybe I should have gone over here instead, because we can't actually go this far down. Which is... I don't know, that's weird. I mean, we can't do this place, we, we, but we can do this place? Wow. Uh, but it's expensive though, so yeah. We might even do a third colony. That'll that'll be crazy though. Uh, how long until we can get that? I I, I want another advisor in this category. Woo! Another diplomat. Sweet. Oh yeah, that's right. I totally forgot about these guys. Yeah, they love me now far too much. Okay, so let's just spend our diplomats on annexing these guys. When it oh come on! I don't want to be at war. Stop this. Can I not be at war anymore? I'll surrender. Nope. Okay. Oh, just another reason to hate Sweden. Huh? I am not surprised. Well, I guess we'll wait then. Sit around and do nothing for a while. Wait for time to pass. Yeah, that's fun. Super entertaining. Here's the thing though, I might actually want to go ahead and expand some more down in Africa. Can I reach this place? Well, it won't tell me. Well, I guess I'll get my explorer over here. Because we have already now explored the coast areas. I don't think I need to do any more down there. Yeah, once uh, I'm gonna actually go ahead and recall him from that colony. And instead, I'm going to put them in this one, because I want this one to finish. I'm more... I feel like that's a little bit more important. So we'll get you out of there. And we'll get the General Herp out of there. And we'll go exploring down in Africa. You. Perfect. Colonization. Colonial discovery. Well. Sure, let's get some diplomatic power. That's by far the most important right now. Okay, we need some troops as well, so let's go pick some 
Pick up some transports and some troops. We don't need that many, so this will do. Okay, um, reorganize. Get two cogs. Put you on a boat. And let's go. Yep, everything is going according to plan. Go down there to the colony and stop there. So, because I want to take a look at the um, Pendle Colony. Hey, more settler increase. Yeah, let's do that. Go. We'll give it some extra revolt risk, but uh, I mean we do have a thing in there, so look at that 80 the air. Sweet. Oh, we have a lot of money now, so let's build that building I wanted. The embassy, yes. Let's build an embassy in... Oh, I don't know. London. Sure, let's build it in London. The London Embassy. And we'll go have some fun over there. Holy War, really? Got the religious ideas going? No, you have exploration. Really? Ha! <laughs> Well, we might actually... We, okay, we might actually see a Muslim... Um, Muslim colony then. That's so fucking cool. But how the hell do you have Holy War? I thought you had to complete the religious ideas if you wanted Holy War. I don't know. I, my knowledge is rather limited. Can you, can you die, Sweden? Can you just, like, not exist? Seriously, you are annoying me. This war is not interesting to me. I mean, I, this is the perfect time to annex my vassals. Yet, Sweeney's like, <laughs> fucking Sweden, god damn it! I should be that 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 that's like the two things in this let's play: hating on Sweden and hating on the Ilkhanate. What? No, go eat shit. I mean, look at that. I get so angry by the Swedes when uh, bullshit like that happens. Start being mean to nations that I have nothing against, really. Oh, well, nope, nope. Uh, we actually do need the guy, so go there. And explore it. So can we get here? Okay. Oh, I think we can. Yep, we can. Sweet. How much further south could we actually go? Because this ex this little travel here is all about seeing. Because I want to get I want to be able to get around Africa and start colonizing um, Asia through conquests, not actually colonies uh, colonists. So uh, or establishing protectorates or whatever. So I want to see how far south we can actually get. No, 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 no. Just you don't need to fight them. Just say hi and leave. You know. <laughs> Uh, can we get this far? We can, so... I don't know, let's go back to the colony and we'll take a look and see if we can go south of Congo. So we won there... Pomeranian piece. I want a piece out as well. Why not? Length of war. Well... I'm not the leader of this, am I? No, thank god. Oh well, you guys repair, and uh, I think, oh yeah, we can do this place now, ooh. Man, these islands are so freaking valuable. Hey, they have a unique thing now. Cool. Cool idea, but I, I, I want to get Canada. I, I need Vinland, it's necessary, you know? I mean, if it was a choice, I might take this, but it, it's a must. I must have Vinland. It's just too far. It's far too awesome to not have. Yeah, but this episode has been going on for quite a while, so I think I'm going to go ahead and end it here. So thank you so much for watching this episode, and until next time, bye.